Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, we're going to take a look at dividing fractions word problems. And we have three examples that we're going to go through in order to take a look at situations um, where we will be able to find the solution using division. So let's take a look at number one here. Lucy has one fifth of a bag of dog food left. She is splitting it between her three dogs evenly. What fraction of the original bag does each dog get? Well, we're splitting something up or separating into groups. So whenever we're splitting or separating into equal groups, we're going to use division. Now, division order matters. So whatever you're splitting up, whatever objects being split up, needs to come first in your problem. So let's think here. We have one fifth of a bag of dog food, or we have three dogs. Which object, thing, person, animal, whatever the case may be, what is being split up in this problem? Well, the dog food's being split up, so that needs to come first. So we need to do one fifth divided by and how many groups are we splitting the one-fifth of dog food into? Well, there's three dogs, so that would be three groups there. So one-fifth of a bag of dog food split or divided between three dogs. So now we can keep, switch, and flip in order to solve this. Now, I usually like to rewrite the problem underneath the division problem, but uh, due to space here, I will write it to the right. So keep, switch, and we need to flip that three, and it'll now be one third. Now we can go straight across and get to our solution. One times one is one, five times three is 15. So each dog is going to get one fifteenth of that original bag of dog food. So one fifteenth of the bag. All right, number two. AJ has one-fourth of a gallon of salt water that he is using for an experiment. He needs to evenly separate the salt water into three separate beakers. How much salt water will be in each beaker? All right, so we're separating into groups. So this is division again, and obviously all these problems on your screen are, but when everything's mixed together, add, subtract, multiply, and divide, we need to know what type of situation we'll use division. And here, we're separating into groups. So we need to think what is being separated. And the salt water is. So we have one-fourth of a gallon and we're dividing it, we're splitting it between three separate beakers. So here, one-fourth divided by three. Keep, switch, and flip. Now we can go straight, straight across. One times one is one. Four times three is 12. So each beaker is going to get one twelfth of a gallon. All right, lastly, number three, Devin has a board that measures four feet in length. The board is going to be cut into one fourth of a foot pieces, a fourth of a foot pieces. How many pieces will Devin split the board into? So we're starting with four feet and we're splitting that four feet into groups of a fourth, right? So we are dividing four by one fourth. What are we splitting up? Well, the board. So that comes first, the four feet divided into groups of a fourth. So four divided by a fourth. Keep, switch, and flip. And both of these whole numbers we can put over one so we have a top and a bottom. Four times four is 16. 
1 times 1 is 1, which 16 over 1 is just a whole 16. So how many pieces will Devin split the board into? Well, 16 pieces. So there you have it. There's a few examples of dividing fractions word problems. Whenever you're separating or splitting into groups, you will use division. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.